Hey, it's uh, September 17th, and uh, guess what happened this morning? Any what big happened? guesses? To Liesl. Yesterday was her birthday. Yeah, so what happened today? I don't know. She got her license. She's on the road. <laughs> she drive, She got to drive to, to school. She passed her driving test this morning, and she dropped Mom off at the house and drove to school. That's awesome. So I, yeah, I think that's pretty cool. I'm, she's a good driver. She really is. So uh, All my kids actually have done fairly well, so... Uh, I'm, we have no accidents in all this time. Wow! So, yeah, and Andrew's 21, so I'm, you know, I say that and knock on something, you know. So, but uh, hey, coming out right now, they're they're putting it together. Is the newsletter? That's all our lovely little stuff. Do we have anything exciting? Oh, well, we do. Do we, Doctor? It's very exciting. Oh, we're celebrating 20 years. Yeah. Yeah, and Invisalign specials and Invisalign team. I guess so. I guess we do have stuff. Sweet. All right. Uh, got quiz winners and all that. So be looking for this, what, in the next week three or so. four days? In, yeah. In the mail next week? Sometime? Yes. All right. It's coming out. Smile Express. That's what we call it, sir. Okay. Birthdays. We've got a ton of them because we've got to cover the weekend. So uh, we've got Amber Allen, Jessica Brown, uh, Amy Carlson, Steve Dunlap. Steve painted the, all our yeah. balls. Yeah. He did a good job. Yes, it did. It looks very nice. I painted this one, though. Yeah. I did this one. Why'd you, you just curl your nose? <laughs> because, Doctor, we have spaces where it's still white. Oh, anyway. Jeez. Okay. Emma George, Debbie Hartley. Happy birthday, Debbie. Uh, Carrie Moore, Thomas Porter. He's a nice man. I like Thomas. Ashton Qualls. Do you know who Ashton is? You know Ashton? I'm sure you do. She comes in here and sometimes in here with Zeppi. Okay, Mary. It's Mary's other granddaughter. granddaughter. You know, she had one yesterday and the other one's birthday's today. She's yeah. 10. She went double digits. Ten. She gives me a hard time most of the time, too. She teases me. And I'm such, where my feelings right on the sleeve, you know. Yeah. <laughs> so, I know. Yeah, isn't that terrible? And then Jim Walker. Happy birthday to Jim. Then we moved to Facebook. And Clark uh, Caldwell, he's helped put in the the uh, the big x-ray unit that we used, the yeah. 3D unit. He came down. He's been down here a few times. Well, that's pretty cool. Stan Lechner, who is also yeah. with Patterson. It's his birthday today. Stan's older than me. I think Clark is, too. <laughs> but happy birthday to both you guys. Uh, then Sunita Jones. I went to school. She's a little younger than me, a couple years younger. Sunita, happy birthday. Um, and then coming up on Friday, we've got Pam Hess and then Haley Anastopoulos. Wow. I'll try to spell that one. No, thank she's, you. I, she's a cute girl. She she and my daughter were friends when they were younger. Right? They, I mean, everybody's kind of gone that, this way, but Haley's a, Haley's a nice little girl. 21-year-old. <laughs> so. uh, Rachel Richie Gregory. You know Rachel Gregory. Happy birthday, Rachel. Uh, Karen DeBono. She's up in uh, in uh, Staten Island, New York. That's uh, Mark Scamardella's wife. They're oh. partners together in, in, their, in, their, in their dentistry. I didn't she, know that. You didn't know she was a dentist? No. Where you been? Yeah, she is. She's I... great. She does all the pretty stuff, and Mark does all the digging stuff. Cool. That's kind of how it works out, I think. Uh, Okay, so, and then, hey, Mark, how you doing? You'll watch it, too. I know you will. Um, Susan Stover, Robinson, uh, another one yeah. we went to school with. Uh, Daisha Keller, she's up at the uh, Pitt State Alumni Office. Happy birthday, Daisha. I see her quite often now that I'm doing that. And then, uh, I didn't bet you didn't know that I have a, my Facebook friend, actually not a fan, but a Facebook friend is Jimmy Fallon. Yeah, you knew I that, did know that. Yeah, yeah. so... Jimmy, not going to watch this, but we'll tell Jimmy happy birthday anyway. Happy birthday, Jimmy. Hope you have a nice celebration, a nice deal going on. So uh, we'll catch the other ones uh, Sunday and then Monday on Monday. No, no, we're not here on Monday. I'm giving I'm giving a presentation on Monday. I'm big one. A big one, yeah. We're, you're, yeah, she's doing it all for me. She's doing all the uh, PowerPoint stuff, and i got to give it, though. I yeah. have to write it. So, okay. But, uh, yeah, I'm doing the Southeast Kansas Dental Society meeting on Monday, so we won't be here. So we probably won't have a video. Not on Monday. Oh, okay, but we will Tuesday. We'll catch everything on Tuesday. Uh, dentures versus implants, isn't that what we're doing? Yes. Dentures versus implants. Which would you recommend over it, the other? Well, it would depend. I mean, like lower dentures, I'd recommend if you, if you don't have, if you need dentures, I'd recommend some kind of implants to go in there to hold them. Uppers, you don't need, Im usually you don't need implants to hold your uppers in. You can do it if you really want to do it. And why is that? Because 
di a, a denture upstairs, a real denture, well made, is going to stay in really well. And so don't go to the expense of putting in implants if, if you've got a nice suction. On the lower, yeah, I would look at least mini implants, if not the full implants. So, so what do you think? Do we cover? Where I'm getting at is why you wouldn't need them for upper but lower is like why would the suction be better on the top? The su why the suction? Because you got a little suction cup back there, that soft pouch sucks in like that. And then also surface tension. Remember that one? Mm -hmm. Two pieces of glass and it's dry, they pull apart. Two pieces of glass that's wet, like that. That's how that works. That's how I tell that. That was a quick lesson on why dentures upper work. So, did I cover it all? Yes. Did we get her done? Yes, link. Newsletters coming out. Link of the day. What do we have? We're going to find one. It's going to be a <laughs> surprise. Sam didn't have one for me. She's Sorry. been working on my PowerPoint. There'll be one down there. It'll be Sam's surprise. How's that? I don't even know what it is. It'll probably be somebody falling down and hurting themselves. <laughs> That's the story we always get. So, hey, uh, have a great weekend, and we'll see you soon.